We do everything together since we were born. It's live. How's everyone doing today? Some people call this childish. Some people call us immature. Some people call us, you know, booby streamers. I feel so lucky and blessed that I was able to be born with two best friends from the beginning. We love cosplaying and dressing up. And I decided to just get my chest larger in order to match the image I like. Today we plan on revealing to our mom that we're looking at options of making our chest the same as Hannah's. And we don't know how she's gonna take it. We're thinking about matching Hannah and getting Wait, so what is the look? Are we doing light makeup or? I think I'll just follow your face as my template. Okay. I think I put too much. I put Whatever, that. if I mess up my makeup, you just my fix sister. it for me, okay? That's why I love you, my two little minions. You guys take care of me. <laughs> yeah, well, you can't take care of yourself, so. Okay, how's it looking? Perfect. Awesome. I think you need to touch yours up a little bit. Hi, I'm Nadia. I am Catherine. I'm Hannah. And, and together, together we are the Capasco Triplets. I was born first. I was born second. And I'm third. I would describe myself as a very type A person. I need to have structure, I need to be organized. I start my day with a routine and I need to have things in order. I think I'm more laid back. I'm very empathetic. I like to analyze things. I'm very high energy. I feel like I'm like the party one out of my sisters. Oh my God, so yeah. Cute. We were trying to do like Powerpuff Girl vibes. You can see that's Blossom. Um, yeah. I was Bubbles and then that was Buttercup. Either we matching outfits or matching themes. It just happens naturally. We do everything together. We've been doing everything since we were born. <laughs> since the womb. <laughs> and we are never going to separate or be apart from each other. I feel so lucky and blessed that I was able to be born with two best friends from the beginning. We share everything. We even share our own little secret language. <laughs> Ever since we were little, our family told us we used to go into the corner and conspire and speak in like baby talk, and it would it was like our own language. So basically, just formed into this. Yeah, we do that to convey little secret messages. Online memes have a lot to say about us. One of the, the names that they coined for us is booby streamers. I just think the gaming community is harsh. There are people that take things more seriously than others. Any streamer on Twitch faces a lot of backlash. I don't care, they can come into our stream and then they say things. It's essentially them just wasting their breath. Some people call us childish, some people call us immature, but there's more to us than meets the eye. People think that we're high maintenance, which we sort of are. I mean, because we definitely love to take care of ourselves. We're just dressing up, like we just like to do that, but then people are always thinking right. it's so sexual. We just like to play around and play dress up, so we don't do it for guys, we do it for ourselves. We don't date. We don't date. I mean, we don't. I'm, I'm with my sisters for the rest of my life. There's nobody else I want to spend time with. People are normally very shocked when they find out our education background. My studies in college was international business, hers was engineering, and hers is computer science. We already graduated with our bachelors, and we have a tech startup, and even have a gaming platform coming out. Of course, we have individual goals, but it, they all align within the same. I want to finish writing my poetry book. That's one. One of my interests is hopefully being able to create a vegan product. My individual goal is getting my fintech startup up, up and running and just making sure that it's operating. Today we're getting ready for our Twitch stream because we're gamers. We've been gaming since we were little, playing all different types of games. So we stream on Twitch and we're gonna get ready to do a live stream. And let's not forget that mom's coming later. We love the sparkly stuff. Oh my God, look at how cute this is. Is that Please. what you're wearing today for stream? I wish, maybe. I'll probably get a span though. I hope not. I It wants me to wear it. It's even stuck to me. I police Nadia's outfits a lot. We're always judging each other's outfit and we're helping each other get ready at the same time. Time. Guys, I just feel like this will look so cute on stream. I know. I'm so I still ready. wish maybe I'll do the, the sparkly bra underneath. <laughs> okay, well, let's Perfect. get ready. Let's get yeah. dressed. Time to get ready. 
and get dressed. <laughs> awesome. Live. How's everyone doing today? Happy Hi, Sunday. We're sending positive vibes and good energy. All okay, right, so maybe we should get a game going. We normally stream for about three or four hours. It just depends. It could even go longer if we want. There are times I, I did like a 12 hour stream. Just being a female in general streaming on Twitch, it actually has been pretty pleasant, except some of the you know, hateful comments we receive sometimes. When we do receive negative comments uh, on the stream, we actually have some like warriors even in our community. They actually stick up for us. Before we know it, the support in our community, they are already they're already on it and they're like blocking them or like they're fighting even with them for us. And it's very sweet of them. Our Twitch community means so much to us. We have the ability to be able to talk about things that are affecting the world from political issues to even personal issues. When we are feeling like we have anxiety or anything like that, we're always very open and we're able to talk anything out with them. So just so lucky to have them. Growing up, I was obsessed with Sailor Moon or Juna, Dead or Alive Beach Volleyball. We love anime and we love cosplaying and dressing up. And I decided to just get my chest larger in order to match the image that I liked. Yeah, she didn't always have those big bad boys. <laughs> Me and Maddie are actually looking to get matching chest augmentation because we would want to look the same. So today we plan on revealing to our mom that we're looking at options of making our chest the same as Hannah's. And we don't know how she's gonna take it. Where were you guys last night? I called and nobody answered. Well, actually... <laughs> Actually, I tried to FaceTime you. I seen that you called. We were at a concert. Okay, sounds like lots of fun stuff going on. How come nobody's been doing any work regarding the skincare line, the vegan food products, any of the other stuff that we've been talking about? We, we have some coming in with week. the pressure. Okay. Well, because if I don't put the pressure, who does? <laughs> me uh, or me. But we do have meetings this week, so we take care of that. You guys have to kind of realize that it's not all about fun. Well, speaking on work, we have something to share with you. This is something that me and Catherine are working on. We're thinking about matching Hannah and getting... I'm scared. What? We are... Contemplating. Thinking about getting our chest done to match Hannah. Um, why is this on the list of priorities of things to do? There are so many other things that need to be done, and this is what you guys find important. I find this ridiculous. Getting cosmetic enhancements has become the norm. As a mom, it's a little concerning. I don't think they need it. I think they're beautiful. They stop traffic when they walk down the street. Mom, you're saying that well, we need to get things done for our business, but us looking alike is part of the brand. Everybody already knows what you look alike. You guys already do things to make you not look alike. Catherine's hair is completely different today. That's because we, we experimented we're just, well, on me we first. We dress up all the time. I agree with you, Mom. I'm actually on no, your No, well, place. I don't agree. That sounds to the gum what you're saying, the gang. It just goes against everything. Everything the gang, really, 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 the gang, really, 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 First of all, you don't even need anything. These are both big enough as it is. I said they're perfect. I think you're right. We need just need to focus on getting the makeup line out. We need to get the food product up and running. I completely agree with you. I think mom has the full scope here. I mean, she's a nurse, she's our mother, and her advice is well-rounded. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she, she can't argue with facts. I agree. One, two, three against one. You're outvoted. You know mommy would never steer you wrong. Yeah. Nadia is trying to bring you to the dark side. Don't listen to her. Yeah. I love you, mom. <laughs> Thank you for coming, mommy. Walk All right. her out. All right. I love you guys. Love you. Bye. Our plans for the future together is to eventually get three houses. Or not, well, just one really big one. I would describe my sisters. They're perfect. Well, they do get a little bit um, annoying. Oh, yeah, you get on my nerves, too. It's okay. <laughs> 